Hello friends, welcome to War Wiki. Meticulous Monday is a series where we try and bring you some latest updates on influential military topics. Today we bring you a topic which seems to be straight out of a sci-fi book. We've all seen what Iron Man can do in the movies, and it's rather impressive. Ultimately, all of his abilities come from the incredible technology behind his suit. What if we tell you that this Iron Man suit can become a reality in very near future? Probably inspired by this technology, the American Special Operations Command SICOM, is turning for their future combat exoskeleton prototypes, which are to be ready as early as mid-2018. Talos, or Tactical Assault Light Operator Suit, was the name given to a robotic exoskeleton that United States Special Operations Command intended to design with the help of universities, laboratories, and the technology industry. The mandate for Talos states that it must be bulletproof, weaponized, have the ability to monitor vitals and give the wearer superhuman strength and perception. The suit would have layers of smart material and sensors. The suit may not be intended for an entire squad, but for a lead operator who will breach a door first, to protect them as they are the most vulnerable team operator in that situation. In 2013, SICOM expanded their development of such a suit. The US Navy SEALs or Special Forces would use these suits for special operations. Rathian, Lockheed Martin, and the company owned by Elon Musk, the owner of SpaceX and Tesla, were few of the companies to rise up to the challenge. While many such projects have had to face failure, Talos exhibits a brighter future. Many in the military fraternity call this project the Iron Man project as well, however, unlike the metallic and clunky suit of Iron Man, these military operators need to move with great mobility, therefore, the suits will be made with a liquid body armor that transforms into solid within milliseconds when a magnetic field or an electric current is applied through the material. Essentially, what's being designed is a suit of armor that remains soft and malleable during normal operations, but hardens instantaneously at the point of contact deflecting and dispersing the immense destructive energy produced by a hit from an enemy round or sharpnel. Talos is reportedly going to be a physiological subsystem that will use various sensors on the skin to monitor the wearer's vital signs in great detail. More than that, it will provide vastly increased strength and will definitely prove to be a force multiplier for the US Special Operation Forces. This exoskeleton is envisioned to be made intelligent and adaptive. While all these features might not be achievable in the 2018 prototype, gradually Talos suit will be focused towards intelligent adaptability. Just like Travis, an intelligent computer in Iron Man movie, the suit will be able to tell the operator the problems and errors which need to get corrected, and soon it may start correcting them on its own. Two very important features envisioned for this suit are assistance in picking heavy loads, and reduced impact of load by intelligent weight distribution throughout the body, this is particularly beneficial during wartime scenarios. Less energy consumption by a soldier can be a real game changer during a war. The exoskeleton is designed to weigh lesser than 400 pounds and assist in ability to carry heavy loads. General Atomics intends to provide the Talos suits with a tiny combustion engine, that can nevertheless run at 10,000 RPM. This technology will rely on Liquid Pistons X engine, which employs the high-efficiency hybrid cycle. According to the company, this engine has a theoretical efficiency of 75%, and can be very quiet since it only consists of two moving parts, a shaft and a rotor. The generator will generate 12 kilowatts of power for 12 hours and is supposed to power the sensors, levers, computers and robotic strength augmentations. A number of world's top companies like Lockheed Martin, Honda, Panasonic, Mitsubishi, and many more are developing partial or full-body exoskeletons which are also called as exosuits or powered armor. They find uses in different industries such as manufacturing, automation, medical or nuclear industry. Some of them can be used by people with disability or perhaps in specialized rescue missions or disaster-like situations. We will soon be out with a list of top 10 exoskeletons, which you will be able to catch by clicking the note on top. There are only two confirmed ongoing development for full-body exoskeleton whose primary function will be to enhance Special Operation Forces capabilities. Apart from the SICOM Talos, Russia too is developing its own Special Operation Exoskeleton Power Suit which goes by the name of Rostec Exoskeleton. It's a combat suit for Special Forces which is in its conceptual stage, but is focused towards pretty much the same specifications as the American Talos suit. There are also speculations that similar armor suits are being developed by the Chinese, Japanese, Indians, Israelis, and the Polish. While various special forces of the world are interchanging their strategies and constantly training with each other, the difference between their capabilities is reducing day by day. With a powerful combat suit such as the Talos, 
the capabilities of American Special Operation Forces will increase drastically. USA is also developing a cloaking suit which will make the soldiers invisible to the naked eye. We will try and bring you more about it soon. Now we would like to hear from you, do you think a futuristic suit such as the American Talos or the Russian Rostec could be a reality? And if they do become reality, what do you think, will such a suit prove to be a real game changer and prove to be a force multiplier for the American and Russian special forces? Do let us know your views by commenting below, let's have a fair unbiased discussion on it. With what we can see right now, the Talos exoskeleton looks like a fascinating glimpse into the future of warfighting technology, only time will tell how successful will it prove for the American forces. We will continue to bring you more videos on future and revolutionary weapons of the world. Do like this video if you found it to be informative. We hope to hear from you, do not forget to subscribe to our channel for many more of such videos. Have a great day and support WarWiki.